it's windy. Looks like it's gonna rain too. Come on, Buster, let's go. What are you doing? Probably smelling where a rabbit has been. Recently, oh, let me flip this camera around first. Recently, I got a comment on one of the Bible study videos that I do. And I'm sure this person meant well or whatever, but all they could say was that it was a sin that I had jewelry and makeup and hair dye. Am I going to hell for jewelry, makeup, and hair dye? No. Does anybody? No. Now, if, I mean, if there might be some extreme situations where your intent is to lure someone else into sin somehow with it but i like hair dye because i like changing hair color i like colorfulness that's, that's why i got eyeshadow on and i've always liked jewelry and shiny anything glitter i love glitter so seriously and what's funny is 90 percent of the time Though you don't always see my bottom. I'm wearing a skirt. Yes, folks, wearing a skirt quite a bit. You know why? Not because I think pants will send me to hell. Now, I know there's Christian folks that believe that they should not wear makeup, not cut their hair or dye it, and wear long dresses or cover their heads or whatever. And that's, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, I, I admire people that they do that but as long as they're not doing it as a work work salvation type thing you know it's just something that they feel feel more comfortable trying feel more comfortable doing buster is running away because he hears the train now we can see my roots right there do i like having gray hair if it was all gray, I'd be all right with that because it'd be like silver and kind of cool, but it's not. It's mixed right now and it doesn't look that great. It's not the cool silvery gray mixed with black that some people have like dark hair and they're, they've got that. It almost looks like it's a professional job or something. That's how, not how my looks. Though I am getting tired of dyeing it red. Mostly because it's so messy. So, I'll try something else that'll kind of blend with these grays and make them look like highlights or something until maybe they're all gray. And then I'll just be a silver fox with makeup on and silver earrings. And I'm not trying to be ugly or rude. You know, like I said, the person probably meant well but did they even listen to the Bible study? You know, it, that had nothing to do with the word. But unfortunately, there are a lot of religious, and I say religious, that means they check boxes, uh, gave my tithes, check. Showed up Sunday, check. Went to Sunday school, check. Went to Wednesday night, check. Not wearing lipstick or earrings, check. I can tell you right now that that does not win anybody over for the Lord. The other day, someone said they thought this kind of it's about actions actions speak louder than words i've said that all my life because i've had a lot of bull thrown at me and the actions said something totally different and the other night i heard someone say they thought saint francis of assisi's quote about sharing the gospel and if if necessary use words was stupid because you have to use words 
Some people don't listen to you when you talk. If you start talking, they're going to tune you out right away, especially if you try to preach at them because they've had negative experiences with religious people like I was just, just describing. So your actions, your kindness, your lovingness, of your Christ-like love, variety of things that you, you could do to show them that you mean what you say, that may be the only gospel they ever hear. Technically not hearing, but seeing. Your actions may be the only Bible they ever read. I've heard people say that too. Come on, let's get go. Oh, I gotta check for my package. I had, I had a notification that something was delivered. Wait, 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 wait. You've got too much lead. You ain't taking off down the road. Forget it. Forget it. Yeah, all these dead trees. And apparently somebody else got the package already. So I got to go check in the house. Y'all have a great afternoon.